Alright, hey everybody, this is Tori, and I'm here with Haven, and we're doing this little um, footage here together, a collab together. Basically, we're going to show you two ways to farm massive gold to be ready for Mr. Pandaria. So, uh, basically, we're both going to take a pot, and most of you know this spot already, but this is some tricks that are going to help you. We'll both take a, um, drink up a pot of treasure finding so drink it up and what's gonna happen is I'm going to put it on free-for-all so that way I don't have to wait on blinking stuff for him he doesn't have to wait for blinking stuff for me and just start pulling and what's gonna happen is alright Haven let's split up okay I'll go over here. Uh, this is this version right here is only if you are by yourself. I will show you a better spot if you're with a group of two or more people. That's going to be the second spot. So uh, roughly you can make about within an hour maybe up to 3,000 gold depending on if you're lucky enough to get a whole bunch of lock boxes and find a whole bunch of uh, blues. If you're a tailor you'll get more money because you get a lot more silks because you have that proc for uh, tailoring. So once you sell all your greens, and if you're a disenchanter, you disenchant the, the greens and blues. Uh, you put them on the auction house and you make some really good money. Uh, depending on your server and how things fluctuate, you can see how much you actually can make. Might I mention that this is our second take because by accident I was doing an ICC 10-man fun run and I ran out of space on my hard drive. So I accidentally deleted this footage. So this is our second time doing this. See how much he appreciates me? See? Oh yes. Hey, I could have ran this by myself, and I was like, nope, I don't want to do it, because I did it, shot it originally with Haven, and that's who I'm going to stay with. See, there's a, tre a treasure chest. And inside those treasure chests is another bonus. So basically, you know, you're really going to come out winning with uh, just farming this. You get an hour, basically an hour, because that's what the flask is for. The treasure chests have up to a max of close to seven gold. If you're lucky to open it, minimum is like four gold. So if you get a whole bunch of those chests, just open them up, and it really, you know, adds up this ele uh, elemental uh, ore in there, water, fire, you name it. You know, there's a chance of that. There's even patterns that open up from there. So if you get those bracer patterns, you can make a good amount of money selling them. I'm going to open right now one of those. Where did it go? I hate my bags. There we go, up there, charge chest. Okay, right over here, I made four gold, 32 silver, seven copper. I got four pyrite ore and four volatile fires. On my auction house, volatile fires go for a lot of money. It's like 200 gold for a stack of 20. See, there's someone else over here farming that spot, a drain eye. So this part is uh, basically a single person. If you're on your by yourself and you want to make some cash by yourself, this is like the best spot to solo grind. You don't, you know, the mobs are easy to kill. You won't get overwhelmed at all. Um, but the next spot I'm going to show you is meant for two people to do. It's if you, you could do it solo. But it, you get really low, and it kind of slows down because they, they spawn so fast that it's really hard to loot. Even with two people, we're going to do it now with two people, it's really hard to loot and still maintain. So, you know, bringing an extra person is not a bad thing. I know people are like, well, then I have to share my loot. It spawns so fast. At least if, the more people you have, the quicker it'll die, the faster they'll spawn, the more time you have to heal. Trust me, healing is very important over here in this next pull. So I'm going to stop footage and I'm going to continue on the next part. 
All right, hey everybody, this is part two, the second area where uh, it, the more people you have, the easier it goes. See this area right here? Um, there are, the trogs really respawn really fast here. So you might be looting and uh, they'll just spawn right on top of you. So loot fast, heal quickly, do everything you can. This is a pretty rush, but it's it's really fast loot if you have three people someone who can maybe throw a quick heal on somebody a healer class it would be a lot easier and faster to do this so here we go we're gonna dive in now and I'm gonna just gather them around the circle we go and Haven follows because he doesn't want to get any aggro and just go They hit pretty hard, too. So, first thing I gotta do is heal. Haven starts looting up as fast as he can. See, look, right behind us, they start spawning. Those are the ones that jump off, but you, you they still, still aggro on you. So it's like really, if you had a healer, you know, you don't have to really worry about um, healing so much. You could just get your quick heal off and keep looting. See, now I just looted everything when I try to heal. But see, as soon as I start healing, there they spawn. See, my main plan is to go around the circle, but they haven't really given us a chance to go around that circle. They keep respawning. So this is what I'm trying to say. like. Uh, if you want to get ready for MOP, you want to bring a friend, this is the fastest way to get gold. I mean, I just got it. At, oh, that's why. <laughs> Everything just said attacking me. I'm like, what did I do? So, uh, yeah, if this is the this is the spot you want to go to. Grab a friend. See how quickly you can loot here? This is the spot. Get that treasure finding. Get the chance of getting that bonus treasure. And whatever you can't sell, you put on the auction house and you make a lot of money. An insane amount of money quickly. In this spot, you could probably make about 4 Gs in an hour. Uh, depending, if you, you know, the more people you have, the more you know you can get to that other half over there that I'm pointing to. And circle around there if you had like 4 people. And it will really increase your time and money. Because... Uh, the, you'll have too much time to loot. I mean, sorry, no time to loot. These things spawn. I'm sorry, I'm like losing concentration, but these things just won't stop spawning. I'm still good on health, but they just, I want to loot. Alright, everybody, I'm going to leave you off with this video. I hope it helps. I hope it's easier for you get to get some gold and get ready for MOP. Um... It's a pleasure doing this video. Haven and I signing off. Later. Say later, Haven. Later. Later, Haven. My tentacles be weaker on ya. Once again, you ruin a video with your ending saying that's gonna be your your uh, way to sign off. Ruin it with a horrible saying. That's my claim to fame.